Yeah, I confess, father, I confess. Cause I've been living. What up, y'all? Back with another one. This is a uh, part two of seeing if, or this is part two of diagnosing the alternator. So, I don't know how I made the video, but I forgot one part. Some people have brought to my attention is, oh, there we go. When you're testing the alternator, you wanna, use that, take off the terminal. I think it's a negative terminal, the uh, battery while a car is running. And if the alternator is fucked, then the car should turn off when I disconnect the terminal, so. Well, let's see right now. I'll show you guys. So right now I'm at 10.9 volts, 10.8. So. Go to the trunk. We're gonna see if it turns off. So, there we go. Oh shit, wrong way. Be careful when you're doing this, that your battery's in a chunk like mine, that you do not hit metal while you're turning this, or it's gonna spark. See that? Just turned off. So that tells me my alternator is indeed fucked. <laughs> so I need to add that in there. That's probably the most easiest way to tell. So yeah. It is indeed the alternator. So shout out to the people who actually told me that. I'm not sure to add that in the last video, but you know. Give y'all part two. Y'all like extra videos, so you know. That is the easiest way to see if your alternator is in fact plus. Because I turned it right off as soon as I unplug the negative terminal. So make sure you guys like, share, subscribe. Information to reach me is always down in the description below. Till next time. Salute.